one of the most I would say annoying grinds in the anniversary is the new free to play LR especially when you want to be lazy and start late the grind can get extremely extremely annoying which is why it's the it's in your best interest to take advantage of each part of the anniversary and do everything that you need to do um, to make sure that when you awaken these characters or when you EZA them, it's a very seamless process moving forward. And there is a lot of work you actually need to do in part one to get it basically, I guess, going smoothly as part two and part three actually release. So I'm going to show you what you need to have done, not only for LR Majin Buu, or I guess LR Bobby, but also for the uh, free to play LR, Her not LR, sorry, free to play tur hercule as well now i do have a really quick subscriber challenge or push-up challenge today i'm not really feeling too well so i'm going to spend some stone why the frick not if i go ahead and do a multi should i do a multi because i kind of want you know what let's just do a single okay if i pull an ssr off the single i caught you lagging you gotta subscribe to the channel you gotta of course if you're new road to 60k by the way i appreciate you are so close and um of course if you are already subscribed drop down and give me eight push-ups but if i don't pull an ssr which i'm not going to the odds are so in your favor i'm not even being fair to myself right but it's okay you know we uh what's one more push-up gonna do to me right um now of course if i don't uh pull anything here which i'm not then um yeah you can skip i mean technically ginyu look this pose comes from an lr ginyu or vice versa but uh, i'll let you off the hook anyway let's hop into this video so what i want you to understand is that when it comes to free to play lrs i'm going to show you something um don't don't take what you see here um as face value i, I grind things a little bit differently um i can ex I'll, I'll explain it at the end of the video if you want let me just give people what they came here for when it comes to what you need to know about grinding um this character here so first things first when it comes to grinding up lr bobbity what you want to do is have your rainbowed copy at tur so level 120 okay now you can give this character whatever you want in the hidden potential um this version of bobbity has full crit for me so i just you know, it doesn't really matter what you, it doesn't really matter what you do okay um but go ahead and uh, get your first copy of lr bobbity completely rainbow so awaken them feed them all copies all dupes all you need 14 copies essentially to get that done right what you're going to want to do after that is get at least one copy of bobbity to sa 10 and awaken that copy i haven't done that just yet but i mean as you can see i'm grinding a lot of bobbities here so get another copy of bobbity to sa 10 and awaken them but don't feed in any dupes the reason why you don't care about dupes when it comes to this copy of bobbity because this bobbity all that's really the only purpose this bobbity the, the you know sa 10 non-duped up bobbity has is just to feed in to your main bobbity once you get them to lr because remember once you awaken a, a tur to an lr their super attack max it goes from 10 to 20. So if you awaken two copies of Bobbity to LR, both are SA-10, you can feed one into the other to make your complete SA-20, right? Once you're done with that, you're going to want to grind up one more copy of Bobbity all the way at SA-5 and awaken them fully. This is going to be for their EZA. So awakening to LR increases your super attack max by 10, but EZAs increase your super attack max by five. So just like before, once you have your SA 20 out of 20 LR Bobbity and you EZA that character, you can now feed in the other LR copy that you awakened that you got to SA five and then feed into your main copy to now have your max super attack 25 out of 25 LR Bobbity for free. No Kai's harmed. And no, you don't have to actually EZA the SA5 copy for those that are probably wondering that. You just have to get them to LR because once they're the same rarity, it doesn't matter. One's easy, and one's not. It doesn't matter at all. Now, if you're curious, I mean, that's pretty much it. And, and it's going to be the same thing for Hercule as well. Um, this is, let me go actually super class here. So when it comes to the Hercule character, again, I haven't done this just yet, but I'm going to. Um, Hercule is going to get an EZA. So what you want to do is, again, have your random, not random, but your regular, that's what I meant to say, 
um, uh, you know, SA 10 copy, fully two paths unlocked. And then you're going to want to have another copy of Hercule at just regular SA 5 because he's a TUR. So his super attack is not going to hit 20 or 25. It's going to hit 15 once he gets his ZZA. So grind up a copy of super attack 5 Hercule and you're going to be good to go. Um, I will say now that you can do it, awaken all these copies of, of Bobbity um to his tur state again i haven't done that yet myself but i'm going to before part one actually ends and part two starts so that way as soon as part two starts i can just i'll be good to go grind metals and awaken i don't have to start from the process or grind more copies of babidi this way it's going to allow you to stay busy during part one um but it's also going to um you know allow the content to spread so that way you're not you don't feel like you're doing so much when part three actually drops right so please make sure to get this grind out of the way that's the end of the video but for those of you curious why i have so many copies let me just explain really quick um i have this really unhealthy grind that i do where i actually like to and i'm starting to do this now for free-to-play characters like for example i have uh three lr copy copies not copies i don't know what that is as you can see three other copies of lr master roshi and three other copies of goku and orale completely done free to play no you know super tag grinding sorry uh no kai's use anything like that um and the reason why i'm doing this is because sometimes right when you're in entering an event some characters you're really going to want them to crit some of them their only role is to dodge and some of them they need those additionals to continue attacking the enemy right depending on the event you're going to need a different version of your character when i realized that i said you know what since i have control over the free-to-play characters not summonable i don't do this for summonable characters not yet at least i don't have enough copies to actually do that um, i'm not truth right but anyways um so with these copies like one copy i de copy why do i keep saying that one copy is full uh crit build one copy is full um dodge build and then another copy the original copy that i had is full additional build now what's also great about this is that if you care about your links sorry yeah if you care about links or your power level it's going to be an amazing thing because you just have more copies uh to actually um like link level and stuff like that right um so just it's extra power level for you so it's the same thing as what i'm that's literally the same thing what i'm doing why, why, why am i not speaking english it's the same thing with this LR Bobbity that I'm grinding up, as you can see, these three copies, but it's this is definitely a lot of work because you need to have three LR copies that are rainbowed one full dodge, one full crit, um, one full dodge, and then one full additional, right? Um, and then you're going to need three. Everything that I told you before is just times three, right? So now you're going to need three copies of um, Bobbity up to SA 10 to awaken all of these to LR and then feed in those SA 10 copies. And then you're going to need um, three SA 5 copies of Bobbity to once you easy all of them, you awaken those and feed them in. <clears throat> and then I'm going to have um, the TUR Bobbity rainbowed and then the SSR of Bobbity rainbow. So I just need a bunch of more, just a bunch of more copies. Um, this is obviously a grind to do if you have a lot of orbs if you don't have orbs do not do this i mean you can still get the job done um but it's like i, I don't even worry about it. this is just something that i do in case you're wondering that's why this video is still going on um by the way but yeah you're gonna need a lot of medals to get this done a lot of runs a lot of grinding it's whatever so yeah hopefully you enjoyed um i will see you in the next one lr bobbity the newest free to play lr for the anniversary <laughs> And it's just something that I feel like you should get done now to save yourself the feeling of, oh my God, there's so much work to do in part two or part three of the anniversary. I'll see you in the next one. Take care and peace.